Hello everyone. Today we're going to be working with aluminum 5000 series. Okay, so you can pretend that this is going to be an assembly that we're putting together from scratch. Now, what would you do when you start, first start putting together an assembly? You would tack it all together. So what we're going to do is we're going to use a dual functionality of the Lightweld 1500 to our advantage without changing any uh, nozzle tips. So we're going to start off by using the tack functionality of the Lightweld 1500. So I'm going to overlap my assembly as so, okay? Now what I'm going to do, even though I have my wire feed attachment on here, I can still use the tack mode. I just turned my wire feeder off so that it's not feeding into the melt pool. So let's first start by getting the assembly together. Okay, looks pretty good. Let's tack one. Okay, tack two. Okay, there you go. As you can see, we're all tacked together. The assembly is nice and secure. I'm now able to do my high velocity aluminum wire weld. Okay, so we're gonna put that down as so. Now I'm just gonna lock this down so it doesn't drift on me while I'm doing my actual weld. Now my assistant right off screen has turned on my wire feeder. So I'm just gonna clip this to length. Looks good. Grab my helmet. And let's do this. Okay, let's take a look what we got here. One wipe of our wire brush, and look at that. A beautiful, beautiful wire weld on our 5000 series aluminum assembly. Now we went really fast to try to prevent any kind of deformation in this part. Let's turn it over, because what I'm making sure, what I'm trying to make sure about is that I didn't blow through uh, my weld at any part uh, during the translation of this weld. Let's take a look on the back. And as you can tell, it's welded. You can see the small um, line of where the weld was taking place, but I did not blow through in any area of that assembly. By using the dual functionality of the Lightweld 1500, we started off with our aluminum tacks, which kept the assembly together, and then we finished off the assembly with our high velocity wire weld. Now, as soon as we were done with that part of the video, I did something offline, I did another assembly exactly like it. And as you can tell, the parts are identical. This shows you the repeatability and flexibility of the Lightweld 1500 platform. If you'd like to learn more about the Lightweld 1500, please click on the link below.